Hi, today I am going to do a very quick video on my skincare routine. I got a lot of requests and questions on this video, but I was very hesitant to make it because I really don't do that much on my skin. But anyways, I'll try to cut down on my talking and just go straight to the point. So, I wash my face twice a day, once in the morning before I go out and once at night when I'm taking a shower. Um, the products I'm using to wash my face are like Clinique's Acne Solution and um, DDF's Acne Scrub. I really actually like DDF's Acne Scrub. After washing my face, I immediately put on my lotion, which is Aveda Botanical Kinetics Hydrating Lotion. I really, really like this. This is like my second bottle. And I have oily skin. I have dry yet oily skin. And um, this works really great for, I guess, oily skin or dry skin. Like, I saw a lot of reviews and they were mostly positive. So whoever is like looking for a nice lotion out there, I think this Avita one will work well for whatever skin type you have. And sometimes, I don't use it often, but when I feel like my skin is getting dry, I do put this Tony Comfort from Lancome on. Like before my lotion, and it's almost gone. And um, it's very milky, and um, I guess it's okay, but sometimes like it kind of stings. So I don't know if it's right for my skin or not. I don't break out or anything, but... I'm kind of hesitant to use it because it sometimes stings. This during the daytime, like right now, I don't have anything on my face, so I feel extremely stressed out making this video. Is I, I am very, I'm very afraid of direct sunlight, and I try to avoid whatever, like like situation where I have to face direct sunlight. I usually walk, like on the side of the street where like there's shades and I don't sit in the sun, I don't go to the beach. I just have this like huge like phobia of sun. So I after I put my lotion on during the daytime, I put on my Lancome UV Expert 20 sunscreen. It's SPF 20. And it's kind of thick. So if you have oily skin, then your skin is going to get really oily during the day, but you know, like they say, like you have to put on sunscreen every four hours or eight hours or so. So, you know, I don't know, but that's what I use. That's basically what I use. And when I have makeup on, before I jump into the shower, I try to take all the makeup off. And I used Shuemura Skin Purifier. And I'm almost out of it, so. At the moment, I'm kind of using samples that I got from Sephora and like other places where I buy my makeup. And um, I really like that Shemra Skin Purifier. This is Cleansing Beauty Oil Premium AO. You could always find alternatives, but if you're looking for a really good cleanser, I do recommend the Shemra one. And yeah, that's about it. Like, that's all I do to my skin. But um, my skin seems very good but if you actually look at it really closely I have like veins like visible veins along my face and I have a lot of acne scars and freckles and here check this picture out this is when I had a lot of acne yeah that was pretty traumatizing I wish I could say that I was born with good skin but my skin is actually really sensitive and since I am very oily, I'm very prone to get acne or whatnot, so um, I think it's not the products that actually help my skin get better. I drastically changed my lifestyle and my diet throughout like the course of a year, and um, I turned vegetarian last year. It's been like a year, and I haven't eaten any meat, and after that, my skin just got so much better. And I cut down on a lot of junky food and snacks and sodas and just unhealthy stuff. I try to like cut them out of my life. And I work out more. I try to swim every day, but I don't put my face in the water because I'm afraid that all those chemical stuff are going to get on my face and it's just going to make my skin look saggier. 
and um yeah like that's about it i i walk a lot every day i try to drink a lot of water which isn't working that much because i'm not that much a big fan of water but i do drink a lot of tea and the only thing i have to really cut back on is coffee because i drink a lot of coffee to go through like a hectic day and I know coffee is really really bad for your skin because it dehydrates you so much and you, you know it's just not good for your skin and your health so if you guys are like coffee lovers just try to try to cut down on that and yeah just thoroughly cleansing your face every night taking a shower every night to get all the dust and like the dirty stuff you got on you like during the day just like get everything out and sleep a lot I sleep a lot I sleep like eight to ten hours a day I, I'm, I'm just like I'm a sleep though I have to sleep a lot and yeah just have a have a healthier mind try to like stick on a healthy diet and your skin will your skin will reflect ugh, what is wrong with me your skin will reflect what you're eating and how healthy you are inside so I think that's the secret of how I got rid of all my acne's and you know how my skin got like a, a healthier tone I used to be really like yellow and just I looked really unhealthy and tired and I still do have that tired look but my skin is definitely more radiant than it was a year ago so alright that's about it I will see you guys in my next video bye